Morning guys. Hope you're all well. I thought I'd start in here today because I uh, just wanted to show all of the pipe and bits that I had to remove from the central heating system to get it working. So the heating is working, the hot water is working. It is so blooming hot in that house now, as in our old house, it's amazing. Integra is up there as well. We chop sort of station set up so I can sort out um sort out the stairs in a minute. Oh, it's made its way up as well. Right anyway, let's get in the house. Generally just tidying up as well. Ah uh -huh. the old death traps is hanging around in there. Right. This deck is so much better since Mason's um Mason's uh jet washed it. Let's go and feed the fish actually. morning fishies hello 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 a few boots not that there's a few of them over here as well but I have to get to film them anyway let's get um this box open <laughs> look at you mate you're missing the food and there they go Tiny fish. Get a decent shot of them. Yeah, there we go. Right, so I'm really tired this morning, my head's fuzzy, so if I'm mumbling or rambling a bit, I apologise. Let's get back in the house. New floor in here is finished. It took a little bit longer than expected just because uh, I need to get it as strong and flat as possible. It's actually now the most solid floor in the house. <laughs> See, it's getting stored, used to storage at the moment. That's all going to go out in the garage later. That's one of the new rads. They're working so well. Uh, kitchen hasn't really changed, apart from a bit of pain. A bit of prep work in here for Vicky to do today, sugar soaping, so she can get the walls painted. I've got to get some plaster on these patches today. I'll get that done first whilst I'm waiting for that to set up so I can start to trowel it properly and polish it. I'll put the stairs together. I'll turn around in a second, look at them. Charlie's room pretty much empty now. Walls have been painted, just need to do a bit more touching in around the conduit when the electrical electrics will run. I know it's not the perfect finish, but we're gonna get it skimmed. Our plaster couldn't get in before the deadline so we've got to wait for that but here's a sneak peek of the stairs I've cut the top and bottom step to length I'll then use them I've used them as a guide to make sure that everything's right nice solid joint on the side here and one over there as well so I've got a fence set up on my circular saw I'll cut every single riser and tread to length the saga of the wallpaper continues Vicky's having a nightmare trying to get this off I try and give her a hand today, but I've got lots on myself. So, bathroom's pretty much done. Kitchen, well, yes, as well. Sorry, the flooring's going down in Charlie's room today as well. I've got to lay the floor because the equipment services people are bringing Charlie's bed and all his other furniture up tomorrow. So, one is ideally had this floor laid today so that that's out of the way and start running into the hallway and then through the rest of the house. I can't show you upstairs at the moment because I'm not one-handed getting up that step ladder and up the top there. And um, I think that's about it. I'm just trying to think of that. Oh yeah, I was gonna show you the, the kit form. This is uh, how the stairs arrived. That's just a pile of wood. So I've been busy making that yesterday. Um, if you finish that today, getting that all cut to length and then whilst that's gluing up 
I can probably smooth out the plaster, start changing some of the sockets around the house as well. That's about it really. Um, it's starting to become more of a house now. There's a lot of hidden things that you wouldn't necessarily have seen us doing. Um, just correcting things, bodges, correcting uh, problems we didn't foresee. But now we're kind of on the, the, the push for the finish because really we want to have this flooring done, painting done, all of that done by Friday. So we can spend Saturday moving boxes in our two larger vehicles leaving only the large furniture to move on the Sunday in the moving van, but we'll see how we get along. I think I'm going to be doing, I've been doing some very long days and nights here, so I think that's going to continue. But anyway, I'll keep you updated. See you soon, guys.